Hi, in this video, we are going to learn about Perkins reaction. That is, we are going to prepare cinnamic acid from benzaldehyde. Let's write the reaction C6H5 CH double bond O. This is benzaldehyde. We are going to react it with acetic anhydride plus CH3 COO. Okay, I am writing in this manner H2 CH CO O CO CH3. This is acetic anhydride. The reaction takes place in presence of sodium acetate that is CH3 COO Na. What happens? This oxygen and this two hydrogen will get eliminated as a water molecule. The remaining thing will get attached. So we get C6H5 CH double bond CH CO O CO CH3. This this compound on further hydrolysis, this compound on further hydrolysis, it gives cinnamic acid. The bond gets cleaved here. Okay, here, water molecule H2O, that is H and OH. To this compound, OH is attached and here hydrogen is attached. So we get C6H5, CH, double bond CH, COOH. This is called cinnamic acid and this area CH3COOH. CH3COOH. That is acetic acid. Let's write the name for these structures benzaldehyde reacts with acetic anhydride. We get an intermediate compound like this. This compound on further hydrolysis, which is attached to this uh, aromatic group and unsaturated group, and hydrogen is attached to this acetate group. Okay, so we get acetic acid here and cinnamic acid here. This is called cinnamic acid. And this is acetic acid. Okay, let's summarize the reaction. When benzaldehyde is heated with acetic anhydride in the presence of sodium acetate, the condensation takes place and we get finally cinnamic acid and acetic acid. This reaction is known as Perkins reaction. Thank you.